Charlie, how would you kind of describe it? I'm excited and nervous, I think would be two words. I mean, obviously, uh, SMU playing well, beating Georgetown the other day. And, uh, Corn beat the Braves off of Cornell. And, uh, very offensively talented. And uh, come back home and play since next we got our hands full. How good, how good is McMurray as far as leaders? Oh, he's, he's terrific, very good in transition. Uh, puts a lot of pressure on him. You know, Witt, good size. Foster's good size. Uh, go. Uh, he's really skilled. He's a, he's a five that can move around the perimeter. Uh, Isaiah Mike is a great energy player. They've got, they've got a good team. You think the team's excited to be tested and, and get ready to go in the A's? I think, you know, we, can, we haven't played a lot of games yet, so I think the guys are ready to get back on almost a little bit of a normal routine. We could go, uh, you know, we go Wednesday, Saturday, which is a little bit more like we've been doing. So I think the guys are excited. We've had a couple of good days of practice. Talk about James Gardner a little bit, what he's done for his team early on. Oh, he's, he's been able to score a bunch of different ways. I think his game will keep expanding. I think that's one of the exciting things about him. I think he'll continue to get better. Uh, he's, he's a very good playmaker. He's a very willing learner. He seemed like, I guess, kind of a warrior out there. He just goes out there with that mentality. Well, he's got great energy. I mean, I, I think he, he, he's, he's consistent. He's a consistent player because his effort and practice is consistent. Talk about going on the road anytime you go on the road, and it doesn't matter really what league you're in. Road games are always hard to get. Yeah, they, they are. I mean, I, I think that's the thing that you, as you go around the ball, you've got to get better. You know, teams that win the championship are able to win on the road, and that's something we have to evolve into. Now that you're in conference play and you're playing teams of this caliber, is it more about, you know, yourself or the scatter report for the other teams? Is it a combination every game? Combination. I mean, I think there's some things that you're looking at. You're obviously trying to figure out matchups, who you're going to put on people. What, what offensive stuff you can run to take advantage of them and what, what they're going to try to take advantage of. With this being such a tough conference, how can you simulate kind of the, the I guess, the uptick in athletic ability that this team's going to see in the next 18 months? Oh, you can simulate it. Mean, that's, that's a recruiting deal. You've got to simulate it in recruiting. With, their, with SMU, it seems like outside of the all their guys are like 6'4", six, 6'5". Six, Reversal, interchangeable lean. pieces, yeah. 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 That, that, that's what Tim wants to do. They're, lank, uh, they're lanky, they're athletic. Um, I think that's what they're continuing. The freshmen are all 6'7", six, 6'7 seven, six, seven and a half. You know, multiple uh, position players. Cool. Excited? Yeah, I'm very excited. First game against SMU, so we're ready to get going and get to Dallas and try to get a win. How tough is it to win on the road? You guys have been on the road, especially in this conference. Uh, it's tough. I mean, it's going to be my first conference game, so I mean, it's just going to—I know it's going to be tough compared to what, we, what I seen last year. So, I mean, we, we got our work ahead of us, but we're prepared. We're working. I mean, we're, we're ready to get going. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry. You have seen some of it. I mean, you haven't kind of played in the games, but you've seen the talent that's in this conference. Have you been able to kind of get yourself mentally prepared? Yeah, mentally, I mean, I've seen uh, most of the teams they've been playing throughout the year, uh, so we've got a chance to watch them at different times on ESPN and stuff like that, so I kind of got a feel for the teams that we're, we're about to go up against, so now it's just time for us to prepare as a team and get ready to go on the road and get it in. Last year, you, like we said, you were sitting on the bench for What did you learn from, from sitting on the bench about what playing the AAC is like? Uh, I mean, I just learned a lot. Just, I mean, just like just the pace of the game and just everything. Just trying to get prepared. I mean, everybody's about the same uh, type of athlete that that I am. You know, going against in the conference. So I mean, I gotta be a, be a step ahead and be on my game, be ready to go. You grew up in Dallas. So how much does this this game mean to you? Uh, it means a lot. I mean, uh, SMU is not that far from my house, so it's kind of good to go home and get to play in front of my family and friends. And, Old coaches and stuff, but I mean, it's, it's a business trip, so we gotta try to get there and get them in. Uh, it's the real deal. Uh, it's a lot of tough, fierce competition, long, athletic, super talented people. But you can compete every day, so it's better. better be excited. Talk about your year so far. Would you have expected to be such a key part of this team so early? Uh, not really, but I just trust myself. I trust my game, and the coaches trust me, my teammates trust me. And I just try to provide for them and try to give them all every day. How much more comfortable do you get game by game? Uh, I'm in an extremely high comfort zone right now. Uh, I just feel like I'm just playing my game to the best of my ability, and the coaches are using my talents to the best of their ability. What's the team's confidence level like heading into conference play? Uh, I think after a win the other day, we had confidence really well. We're playing really good defense. But we started three balls to go in. We're moving the ball really well. They're practicing good, so that's a good thing. When you guys play a team of this caliber, is it more about yourself? Is it a combination of focusing on yourself and the opponent and what they do well? 
Uh, it's just about preparing for the game plan and executing right, believing in coach, and then we just got to go out there and we got to compete. We got to put all the chips on the table.